we're now doing the hold down rods and to um, start a bit of preparation a bit of a, a tip is this is a winding lock nut on the top but once it gets to the top it'll keep free spinning so what we do is grab the claw of our hammer or some pliers or a chisel or something and just blur that over like so wind that up and then it stops spinning and the idea behind that is when you're doing the nut up underneath that won't twist off up the top because we've got no access to put a spanner on top of this it's a self-locking system so we don't want it spinning off and the rod's lost in the wall so now we'll drop it down into the hole we've got a guy underneath and he's going to locate the bottom and put a nut and lock it are you ready, guy, underneath? Watch your head. And then what I'm doing now is I'll grab the camera. And what I'm doing now is you can see the other one's already in there. And we just get the hammer and bang it down below flush. The timber is quite soft, so we bang it down flush. And now our lining boards, ceiling lining boards, will ride over the top. When doing your rods, you're putting your rods through the walls and coming under the beam like so. <coughs> Always paint a little bit of anti seize on the thread. This is quite important. It's very important because it stops the fusing of the of the nut onto the rod. So when you need to retension the rod, you you will be able to readjust. And if you don't do it, you get a bit of curling on the on the thread, and the, and the nut and the thread does jam and you can't tension up your rods and it gives you problems down the track. So anti sees very quick solution. Um, put it on every time on all the rods. Give it a give it up. Tension up the rods very firm, but do not over tighten them because if you over tighten the tight end rod, you can put a twist into your wall. So get them up very firm, but do not crank it up over tight course you will you can bow your wall. Tightening up the nuts here. Keep the dirt, boards all firm and together. Put on anti seize first. Don't over tighten them. And if there's any movement in the boards you come back and retention them at the change of seasons.